Toto. Toto. Well, if I quit school to do YouTube videos, I might as well smash all of my school supplies I no longer need. Hmm. Let's see. No. 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 Ah, the perfect board smashing. Hey guys, welcome to Board Smashing 2018. This is the TI Inspire CX CAS. And it's one of the best graphing calculators you can buy. This was my graphing calculator throughout three years of high school and two weeks of community college. Unfortunately, I graduated college early because I'm so smart, so now I no longer need this advanced piece of technology. This thing holds such fond memories, such as the notes I typed in to study for tests, the wholesome drawings I did, the YouTube video scripts I wrote in class, and the Game Boy Advance ROMs I figured out how to emulate on it. Huh. No wonder why I barely passed high school math. Even with all of those great memories, I still want to be the first tech destruction channel who's crazy enough to smash something like this. Never done before. Usually, it's the little kids who cry when I smash technology. Now, I think I can hear the college students crying when I smash this. Let's get right into the destruction! But first, I gotta say, I have dropped this thing so many times in my math classes, and it survived all of those drops. I have sometimes wondered if this thing can survive an angry student throwing it out of a school's second story window. Hmm. Uh, homework is gay! Uh. Huh, why? Yes it can. Wow. Hmm. <laughs> Gotta say, I'm pretty impressed. Yeah, it can survive something like that. Do what you want with that information. There's just a little crack right there. Now, let's go do some real destruction. Before I start, I should mention that if I don't upload after this, I probably got possessed by a ghost. Why is that? Because this calculator once belonged to someone who's now deceased. And how do I know that? Well, before I got this calculator off of eBay several years ago, I messaged the seller asking how old it was. Because I needed to know if I needed to replace the rechargeable battery it came with. The eBay seller told me that his brother owned it for three years before he passed away. Okay man, I am really sorry for your loss, but that may have been just a little bit TMI. And yes, I did have to replace the battery after a year of use. Whatever, who cares if I get haunted for life if I smash this calculator? I'm a Play Rug Vlogs 124-er. So first, we're just gonna start by, huh? That didn't even do anything. Second try. Aw oh, man, maybe a change of tools will help. Uh oh, it's off. The keyboard may have popped out a little bit. Let me snap that back in, but will it turn on? Nope, I guess it's already dead. Probably would be better if I took out the battery for now. Four! There's a piece right here. The back cover is kinda bent. Screen cover, the screen itself, and the keyboard and circuit board. That was good, but we still haven't got any of the keys flying out yet. Huh, 
I guess the keys don't want to come out. When something's dangerous, just try it again. Good enough. That smashing was a little bit quick, but I still had fun. Thank you guys for watching, comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later with some more videos. Unless there was an angry spirit inside this calculator looking to seek revenge on me for destroying its home. Oh well, bye! Well, this board smashing was a great way to start off 2018. 2018 will be the first year where I don't have any school to worry about and can focus primarily on my YouTube channel. Now that I think about it, smashing this graphing calculator for a YouTube video symbolizes that change. Whoa. School!